Yuan Xiao Festival. Wow, today is the last day of Chinese Lunar New Year. Mm. We'll call it Yuan Xiao Jie. Hey, So Chu, do you know what is Yuan Xiao Festival? Yuan Xiao Festival, a lantern festival, is to celebrate the last day of Lunar New Year. Oh, lantern festival, so we can eat mooncake and play lantern la. Ha. That is for Mid Autumn Festival la. Huh? Do not confuse Mid Autumn Festival with Yuan Xiao Festival, it's a different thing. Oh, so how do people celebrate the 15th day of Chinese New Year? You are Chinese leh, why you don't know? I'm Singaporean Chinese, better no, a bit different from traditional Chinese eh. Oh. We are multiracial society. Oh, so what, what do you know about Chinese New Year? Eh, I know New Year Eve oh, we will eat together as a family. Mm-hmm. Then first day of Chinese New Year we can take ang pao. Hey, yeah, you more you worse than me. Eh. What? The reunion dinner oh, is New Year Eve. It's uh-huh. called Tuan Yuan Fan. Oh. And the first day of Chinese New Year is a visiting day. Mm. Normally, people will also go to the temple and pray for good luck on the first day of New Year. Oh, then first day till 15th day, is it the same? We can mm. go visiting every day and take Hampa, right? No, the second day is the day where married daughters go back to their mom's house to visit. We call it Hui Niang Jia in Mandarin. Huh? Cannot go back on the first day, meh? Mm-hmm. Then, what is it on the third day? On the third day of New Year, normally people don't visit friends and relatives because people believe that it's easy to get into argument on this day. Oh. But, this is real old fashioned people practice la. Oh. Now more young people they don't care already. Yellow yellow I young people ma, so I don't care. And continue to take ang pao. Mm, on the fourth day you can continue to visit friends la. So but one very important thing the old people like me will do uh, is mm. stay at home to wait for the god of wealth <gasps> to come to wow. visit me. Cheers, I said. <laughs> These are very important. <laughs> money, money, money. I like oh. to be rich, ma. Hey, the fourth day I went out for visiting. Nah, tam now, tam now. And really, all oh, the god of wealth came and waited outside my house. Then nobody and went off. No <laughs> wonder I didn't have any luck. <laughs> the fifth day of Chinese New Year, most businesses will resume because they believe it's a good day to start work. It's Kai Gong Yi. Huh? I also never start work on the fifth day, leh. That is old practice, ma. Oh. Sixth day is the day to clean up and tidy the house. Uh-huh. And seventh day... Ah, this I know. It is a no Yes. The seventh day is known as the birthday of all human beings. Happy birthday. Ren Ren. Yeah. Chinese will have different ways to celebrate this occasion. Mm-hmm. In Singapore and Malaysia, we will gather together to toss raw fish salad called yu sheng. Eh, I like to eat yu sheng eh. Yes. But I always cannot remember all the steps. Which one to add first and what to say. Ah, this one ah, you ask the right person now. Okay, okay, you show me, I write down so next time I can demo to my family ma. Mm, okay, so you get ready yeah? Okay. okay. First, the big plate of colourful raw shredded veggie will mm-hmm. consist of carrot, uh-huh. red yam, red pickled ginger, symbolise good fortune, that is hong yun tang tao. Hong yun tang tao. The white radish symbolises improvement and promotion, that is feng sheng shui qi, bu bu gao sheng. The cucumber and the green yam symbolize stay forever young. Qing chun chang zhu. Qing chun chang zhu. The pomelo symbolize good luck. Da ji da li. Da ji da li. Wow, yum yum. Then, 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 then. Mm, then you will have other ingredients to add to the, the dish. And this is the time where you will add one type of ingredient at a time. Mm. And as you add them to the main plate of vegetable salad, you will say auspicious greetings. Okay. okay. First, slices of raw fish symbolizes abundance throughout the year. Nian nian you yu. Nian nian you yu. Oil symbolizes ten thousand fold profit in your investment and many source of wealth. Yi ben wan li cai yuan guang jin. Yi ben wan li cai yuan guang jin. The ground animal symbolizes wealth and treasures. Zhao cai jin bao. Zhao cai jin bao. The Chinese five spice. Powder symbolizes blessings to your family. Wu Fu Lin Men. Wu Fu Lin Men. Toasted sesame and white pepper symbolize prosperity for your business. Sheng Yi Xing Long. Sheng Yi Xing Long. Plum sauce symbolizes sweetness and loving. Tian Tian Mi Mi. Tian Tian Mi Mi. Crushed roasted peanuts symbolize a house full of gold and silver. Jin Yin Man Wu. Jin Yin Man Wu. The pork tree crackers symbolize gold. Everywhere filled with gold. 遍地黄金. 
遍地黄金。And to round up, we will wish everyone Happy New Year, 新年快乐。And then everybody will start to toss the salad and say, 快乐，或恭喜发财，或 any other auspicious greetings. Like what? Like what? I always hear people say 快乐 only. Aiyo, there are so many to say, but they are all in Mandarin. I can't possibly translate them more. Just make、mm. sure you don't say. Ah、uh, oh eh, yeah, 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 yeah. This is not something auspicious, ha.、Huh? <laughs> I always hear people yelling and shouting when they toss the yuzhen, but they tend to say, "Wah ha 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 ha." I don't know what what do that mean. Yeah yeah. Ah,、uh, this is so interesting, but how very complicated, eh? How to memorize the sequence? Actually, there is no fixed sequence, but normally the raw fish will be added first, and the pork chop、mm-hmm. crackers will be added last. Anyway. Every ingredient symbolizes good luck and well wishes, so it doesn't matter which one comes first.、Oh. For businessmen, they will prefer to prioritize the blessings on their business or profit. For students, they probably emphasize more on their achievement and studies. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know. So students will say something like 学业进步、mm-hmm. and newlywed will say 早生贵子 Correct. So make sure next time when you toss your sister, you don't just say ah yeah ah、uh, uh, uh, say something meaningful lah. <laughs> Okay, I will take note of that. So after day seven of Chinese New Year, what's next? On the eighth day of New Year, the、mm. festival celebration part will come to a break, and everything will be back to normal.、Oh. People will try to finish up the food stored in their fridge, and the Hokkien Taoi's family will get ready for the celebration of the Tian Gong, which is the Lord of Heaven's birthday. That is、oh. after eleven o'clock at night. Why do they have to celebrate the Lord of Heaven's birthday? How do they celebrate, and why is it after eleven o'clock, huh? Because the Hokkien believe that they are the descendant of the Lord of Heaven, during the early days, life was difficult, and the ancestor has blessed and protected them in many ways. So on the ninth day of Chinese New Year, they will prepare lots of offerings, incense, and joyous paper to the Lord of Heaven to celebrate the big day. The reason why the offering starts from eleven p.m. on the eighth day was because in the ancient time, eleven p.m. to one a.m. is considered midnight. That's zi shi, meaning it's already the next day, which means the ninth day of New Year. Also, that is what they have been doing.、Mm-hmm. No wonder I always see people burning things during Chinese New Year.、Mm. So after offerings on the ninth day of Chinese New Year, what else do they do, ah?、Uh? Mm, after ninth day of New Year, especially with so much food and offerings to the Lord of Heaven, the family will have lots of food to consume, to enjoy, to eat, and、mm. you know have the blessing、yeah. for the continuous days. Oh, I didn't know that.、Mm. So how do we celebrate the last day of Chinese New Year? All I know is my family will come together and eat. The fifteenth day of Lunar New Year is the Chinese Valentine's Day. Wow, this is so coincident.、Mm. Today is fourteenth February, also Valentine's Day.、Mm-hmm. So we can receive two gifts, lah. Since both Valentine's Day falls on the same day, ma. And do you know this will happen only once every nineteen years?、Oh. So today is really a very、wow. very special day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. I think I will receive many many gifts today. Yeah, since、hopefully. it is such a special day. <laughs> mm. Mm, I don't know who to go out with today. Eh, so how nice, oh! If all someone propose to you or you get married on this day, oh, so romantic. Yeah, 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 yeah. Eh, choose after me. What? I feel like you're so super super smart today, leh. <laughs> you know so many things, and this is the first time you taught me so much. <laughs> Because I Google, ma. Wow. <laughs> oh, now you learn how to Google stuff, good right? Google very helpful and yeah, look. Now all the learning pattern ah become very different compared to olden days. Teacher never teach ah, you won't know ah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Today we'll never talk about anything related to video. Uh、mm-hmm. huh. I wonder what our viewers like to see from us, eh? Since today is such a special day, we will give our viewers a break、mm. and a chance to tell us what they wish to see and hear from us. Yeah, no yeah, point. Yeah. We kept sharing. We kept talking, and then it, it's not what they want, ma. Yeah lor, yeah lor. So do let us know what do you prefer or want to know about in the comments below. We will try our best to meet your needs. Remember to tell us what you want. Don't just、mm-hmm. sit down there, watch and keep quiet. Then how we know what you want? Then you must tell us. Must let us know. Yes. So subscribe, like, and leave a comment. Happy Valentine's Day, ha! Enjoy your day with your loved ones. Wah! Happy New Year! Happy New Year!